Welcome, my name is a Xiaomi Redmi 9 and today I will show you how to record screen on a device. So to start off, let's pull down the notification panel, extend it, go to the second page and the toggle at least for me is right over here. So you can hold it, this will take us to our recorded option but we also have uh, these settings here. So normally if you already recorded something it will be visible right over here. And if you want to change some settings, you can tap on the settings button, obviously. And we have things like resolution. I would keep it at 1080p. Uh, this will ensure that the video looks as crisp as it can. Video quality. Uh, so here, the farther you go, uh, the more space it will take. Uh, 16 megabits per second um, seems to be good for like middle quality, I would say. If you want more detail, you can go up to, for instance, 32 um, or 24. I don't think there will be much of a difference between 32 and 40 um, in terms of quality, but you can test it around, uh, record it. Now this quality will be only visible in, in for instance, things uh, that move. So videos, gaming, stuff like that. On a static screen, uh, you could keep it at, for instance, one megabit. And the, as long as it isn't moving, the quality will basically be there. So change it to however far you want. Uh, then we have the uh, orientation. I'll probably keep it as it is. Uh, this basically um, ensures that whatever position you're holding the phone, that's uh, also the position that the video will be recorded in. Uh, then we have sound source. So by default, set to system sound. You also have mic or mute. Now there unfortunately isn't a way to have both a mic and sound system. So you will have to pick and choose. If you're playing to record games with like commentary, uh, your games will have no sounds or you won't be able to comment on anything. So pick whichever one you want. Uh, then we have fixed uh, frame rate. I would advise to keep that on. Uh, this will ensure that the video has a uh, static uh, amount of frames instead of, for instance, changing. And then in the frame rate, I would actually set it to 30. Unfortunately, there is no 60, so that's a little bit of a shame. Uh, but yeah, I'll at least go to 30. Um, so this will ensure that the video looks as uh, smooth as it can. Now the settings that I'm going through uh, are basically settings that are designed for the video to look the best it can, almost. Um, so yeah, now recording options um, to have a lock screen to end. So if you like well, the screen, it will end the recording and save it. Show touch gestures, so whatever you will be touching, that will be recorded as well with this semi-transparent uh, dot that will be shown right under your finger. And then we have uh, visualize navigation buttons, um, show prompts when pressing home menu and a back button, so you can enable that if you want. I don't really want it. Uh, go, uh, go back to screen recorder, so when you stop recording, it will open up the uh, previous page. So page that I, if I back out of where everything will be saved. And that's about it. We have no settings for cameras or anything, so we're limited to this. And from here, if we leave it, go back to the toggle and tap on it. Uh, low battery, uh, resume, whatever. So as you can see, it's already recording. Now this overlay right here that I can move around is not visible in the recording, but me touching it and dragging around will be visible uh, as a this kind of finger movement on the screen. And whatever I will be doing right now is basically being recorded. Um, so yeah, now to finish it, Simply tap on the red square, there we go, it gets saved. And like I said, uh, we can access the uh, the video by basically holding the toggle. And there it is. So tap on it, and from here you can view it. Oh, and there's my finger. As you can see, uh, that's kind of what I meant. Uh, this is, oh, there we go. I probably should have started like that. So as I said, the overlay is not visible in the recording. So I'm kind of just moving my finger, but the overlay isn't there. And there is also me just messing around. Just so I have something to show. Uh, and obviously that is basically all we can set up here and how we can use it. So if you found this very helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.